Hi guys, Aramism back with you. We be going again. We be raiding. Colosseum, level 6. No more to say. We're about to go Maximus Decimus Meridius up in here, so shall we do it? Let's do it. Get your best gladiator faces on. Let's get in there. So yeah, first room. <laughs> Just have to kill him that. There is an alligator in here. And yeah, quick start. Straight into it. Dive straight in the water. There's nothing in here. It's quite a big waste of space. But when we come up here, pull out to the left. And head over and jump, just jump on this little raised bit. There's two lines that come out. And now, just down there, look, just emerging from the shadows on the left, look along the line of the columns down the left. You can just see that other line, look. I don't know what it is that actually makes him spawn. But, uh... Here he comes. And there he goes. There are actually three at the start. I like to get rid of the third one, to be honest. Saves the jump scare, because later on in the level I never remember it. And he spawns on this second step. Just here. So, on there. He will be chasing me. I've got the volume down really low, so you might be able to hear him roaring. But, head back out here, it's quite cramped in that room, so he can be a bit of a, a bit of a pain. We'll bring him back to the usual bit. Down he goes. So there are the three. Typical Tomb Raider, we can't go just waltzing in through the front door, we have to find our way in. Which is down this way. So... On wood. <laughs> Come here. Quick hop. Now, for all you uh, item hauls like myself, to go on with the level, we're going to go up there. But not just yet. As I said, there is a large medipack at the end of here. That's all. Whether you're big on the items or not, but hey, every little helps. And head back to pull ourselves up. So how are you guys? How you been? Good, good. Me too. Happy days. So up we go. Okay, so to go on with the level, we head down there, but it is secret time. So walk to the edge, line yourself up just with that opening that you can see above Lara's head. You won't reach it, but that's the place to be aiming for, and you'll land there. Aim for the left side, because just there, try not to bang your head, because she will fall and slide down. Again, the volume's low. I hope it chimed, but if it didn't, trust me, this is a secret. So, we head back. Just to that flat platform there. <laughs> it was a close one. 
and hop in and through we go so secret one out the way right again low volume for me so I can't hear him but there's a couple of alligators crawling around down there we can just see what the area is so if we shimmy across not all the way because we're just getting spoiled it's secret time again again tempted to find in Tomb Raider 1 though they do sort of you do find a couple close together and just the shotgun shells again not very generous for a uh, a secret stingy stingy idos and we turn around and grab just there you can see at the bottom just to the right that the alligators have just walked over that small medipack again don't have to get it but It is easier to shoot the alligators over this side because just there, they can. You shoot them from that side, they tend to go under there. And with me anyway, they just never come out. Saves a lot of frustrations and uh, naughty words. So small medipack, pack. That's it for down here. You can just go here to pull up. Don't know what Lara was doing there. <laughs> and we watch Super Fast Shimmy in again. So, once we get over here, we're actually going to head into the Coliseum now. So, plenty of things to shoot in there, including our old friend Pierre again. Yes, he's back. It'll be a while yet till we get rid of him. Oh Pierre, you litterbug. <laughs> Gotta love that line. So yeah, nothing over there. That's a dead end, so we drop down. This lever here is why we killed that third line at the beginning. Because as soon as you open that, it comes around that corner. And out here is the Colosseum. And Pierre will be out here somewhere. The amount of bullets this guy gets pumped into, why can't he just die? And there he goes. He's gone. As you just saw what Lara was aiming at earlier. A few things in here. You can't aim at that Lara, really. God damn. It. Three things in total. A couple of lines and a gorilla. Really, it's just there. Come on. There we go. Get him while he's close. Come on, go down. God damn it. Okay. Looks like they're not playing ball today. You can a lot of the time shoot him from that vantage point, but
Sorry, I can't, I can't hear them when they go down, so... Yeah, a bit, of, bit overkill there. Sorry there, Mr. Kitty. More bullets than bones. So, anyway... Once those three are down, head into the dead opposite corner of where I've just dropped down. And we're going down here. More enemies. Two more lions, I think. So as soon as we go down here. Is that lion glitched? No, he's not. <laughs> so yeah, as you can see, pretty tight. You gotta keep your wits about. You keep jumping. You'll be fine. I just did it. So there's a boost for everyone. Nothing else in here. There's just two levers. This one. Just there to the right of that gate, did you just see his little mouth poking out? An unspawned lion, we'll see him in a minute. But that opens uh, a gate again, right in the opposite corner to where we are again. And this one lets us out. So. Out we go. Just where we came in, this puts us in a pit. And. Save it while you can. You're not in this pit again, so might as well use it. And just get my bearings where we are. Is that the balcony? No, we're heading that way. Because I think there's again two or three things that spawned. And as soon as we pull up, I'm gonna run like hell, being the man that I am. They followed me. Yeah, they have. Come on, come on, come on. God, these take some bullets. Here he comes. Come on, come on. Damn, that one goes. And that's three more. We've still got the unspawned one in that little cutscene where the gate was opening. And if we stand just there, look between the V of those two rocks, you can just see the white of his teeth smiling away. Plenty of room in this Colosseum. Plenty of room. Don't always have to go back to that corner, obviously. Keep jumping. Again, you'll be fine. And into another bit. We're flying through here. Right, now it's puzzle time. Got to be quick on this one. So, two gates. Uh, the eventual goal is to open that door just there on the left. But around this corner. Again, no pickups in here. We stand on this pressure pad, it lifts both the gates, head into the left one first. And it is all time, so be sort of snappy about it. That pressure pad on the right, it doesn't do anything, it kind of just leads you away. That's only there if you get shut in, which for the first gate you've got to be pretty slow. And again nothing, come straight out, straight into here. <laughs> Pretty nonchalant there, but we did it. First time. And that opens up. And there we go. And oh no, we're locked in. There's a medipack for you. Fear troubles. 
hop back onto this one, and that's what opens it. Out we go. That's another section done. I mean, oh. and out into here. Don't know why I'm pulling the guns. The spikes. Again, we never come near them because up there. God damn it! Inverted look. Up there, it's just a hole in the middle of the uh, the Colosseum floor. Just if you fall into it. And again, we do have to come down here again, actually. But with it being the puzzle, we'll save it again. We don't want another uh, Saint Francis's folly mishap now, do we? Okay, well I don't. <laughs> You may, you may do, yes. And pulling up. A few ledges to climb up, sure it's the left. Yes it is. And climb up. Again, another little bit for uh, us item whores. It's not a secret. But it's tucked away in a corner. Just here. Hop through there. Some shotgun shells for your troubles. So out onto here. And now we're going to jump across to that balcony just above Lara's head. Um, these two blocks that are joined to this one, that one, or that one. Sure, you can make it either way. Just as a mental thing, I think I always jump from this one because it seems shorter. Onto there. There's nothing up there, up that way. Walk to the edge. It is a running jump. Press action nice and early, or she will go smashing into the wall. Couple of gorillas. Up here. Eventually goes down. Did quite well on the battle in today, not many hits. And apart from this guy, and famous last words. <laughs> How I got away with that, I don't really know. <laughs> it's always when I decide to open my mouth. It's strange that. Strange. Overconfidence, kids. It's not the enemies that kill, it's overconfidence that kills. <laughs> so, this block, I hope it's pull it out. <laughs> yeah, it is. And you can just see the edge of a switch. I think there's another medipack in here. Can't remember, large or small. Small, I think. Opens another door. And these are the doors that are now around the edge of the Colosseum. So we've got to go back out and get those. So back out, follow. Is there anything else spawn out here? I thought there always was, but I thought there was a gorilla. Obviously not, never mind, I'm not complaining, one less thing to fail on. So just a standing jump off there, we'll get you back. And head to the corner here where we first came in. All those many moons ago it feels like now. <laughs> Probably about 15 minutes. And out of this corner. Main enemies on this part, bats. The one shot wonders. Just two. Is this the one with the idle one? Yes! There's a third bat up there. For all you kill whores out there, do you know how to spawn it? I don't think I've ever seen that thing move. Ever.
Don't pull up. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> no words. No words. Okay. See back at this pit. Okay. Should we try again? So, if we just take our time a little bit, you can just see right above Laura's head there's the boulder. And, yeah, should we just try not to pull up this time? So, we jump, we jump, we hang. And wait, wait, Arabism. Yes, applause, please. Yeah. Still pressing forward from jump, you see? That means you pull yourself up. But, yeah, not as though we've already played five or six levels already. To be used to that fact. Hey ho! See, you get your laugh eventually. Patience is a virtue, you see? You get your laugh eventually. So yeah, we pull the lever. And we just carry on moving round. The Colosseum now. Okay. Refresh myself with this bit. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. Is Pierre gonna turn up? I'm not sure. I think he's here. Is he? Ah, no. But what has turned up? is a line. Or will do. There it is. Down it goes. Because if you keep running and you jump over that thing, you'll end up... There he is. quick. When he wants to be our friend Pierre is lightning quick. Lightning? <laughs> but anyways, the next door I've opened is that one just there. I think there's two more bags. Yep. Yeah. No lazy one this time, but uh, right, secret time. And you have got to be quick on this. Because it is timed. But the reward at the end of it is magnums. I find it's easy just to aim slightly left and then it's just holding the jump button down and Forward, right, back, left, forward. Should we just try and do it? Let's do it. Whoops. Okay. So, forward, right, back, left, forward. Oh, yes. Did I redeem myself a little? Just a little. Yes. See, it's not the hard things. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. It's not the hard things that get in my way. It is the damn simple things that get in my way. You know that, but... Plenty of pickups there. A couple of medipacks. And our magnum guns. There they are, with 400 bullets ready to go. Happy days. But the main reason you come in this room is for the lever. Yeah, run and jump over there, and it's no problem. Pull that. And that is on the next one round. So we carry on around the Colosseum. I think that's the last time we've seen Pierre. I think. For this level, anyway. Sadly, not for the whole game. 
He does continue to be a thorn in our side. And there it is. Don't think there's bats in this one. Nope. But for you eagle died ones, it's another lever. So pull that, and it taunts you. There it is. It's like, oh, the end of the level. Not quite. Not quite. Got a little bit left. Dive into the water and swim out. Another medipack. Could start our own hospital soon. And mm, push. And then round this side and pull once. And we get the key to a keyhole that you probably saw when I killed the two gorillas up on that balcony part. There it is. In typical Tomb Raider style, the biggest keys in the world. They like keys to cities. So. Now, do we swim back through? I think so. I think so. <laughs> Famous last words. Dangerous things happen when I think. I just get visions of Pierre coming back at any every point. <laughs> so to get back up on the balcony, we gotta go back down, back through that uh, that puzzle in this far corner. There he is. Is there anything else? Nope. So back down this puzzle, thankfully for all you guys, I don't have to do it again. Back through here. So we can do all the climbing up and then the jump bit again. So a little back on ourselves. Not too far away now, though. The end is in sight. Back up there. Again, pick your block. Doesn't really matter which of the two. Hop over. Back up and grab. Might as well, because that door that opened at the bottom, I can't remember what is there. Please don't make me jump. Oh, it's a save crystal and a medipack. Okay. 
Not long to go. There's the keyhole for our novelty sized key. Whoa, what is that guy doing to that guy? <laughs> While Laura stood there, it just doesn't look good. Okay, so down into the water we go. Wrong way. There is an alligator, I don't know if you'll be able to see him. But if we can beat him, oh, it's going to be close, it's going to be too close. Yeah, he's a little bit of a sod to kill, because you've only basically got this hole to shoot him through. Eh. We'll leave him to swim around. So for you, he's going for all the kills or whatever way you challenge yourselves. Good luck, because that'll take some time. But we'll pull that lever which opens the end. And we just swim to safety. And through to the entrance to Palace Midas, which is where we're heading next. Time taken beats 25 minutes by a second. That's, that's about average, really, for what I remember. 23 kills, 14 pickups, all the secrets again. Apart from a little uh, jump trouble, we did alright. We got there, so... Level 7 next, Palace Midas, which can be a long old level if you don't know where you're going and what you're doing, so... Yeah, there's more potential. I think you'll be back. Because I will, obviously, join us again. Thanks again, guys. I've been Aramism. Aramism. And again, Miss Croft. Out.